Hi everyone, today we're making one of my favorite breakfasts. We're making avocado toast. This is the best recipe for avocado toast out there. You'll never need to look for another avocado toast recipe. Once you've made it, you'll be making it again and again. Uh, it's so much fun to make and it's so quick to whip up. Um, there are a couple of variations that you might like to try out, so let's get started. For avocado toast, you will need nicely ripe avocados. So for one person, I'm using one avocado today, and sunflower seeds or pumpkin seeds, some hot chili flakes, and you'll need some kind of cheese. Uh, I like to use the spreadable cream cheese with a little bit of garlic flavor or you can use crumbled feta. So the easiest way to cut open your avocado is to slice all the way around like this, give it a twist and remove that seed carefully. And we're going to scoop out the flesh of the avocado simply with a spoon and we can spread it onto our toast. So use your favorite toast, a whole meal uh, bread slices is the best for this. So once your bread is toasted, you want to work quickly because you want to serve it before the bread becomes cold. You can either mash your avocado separately and then spread it onto your bread or just directly onto the bread is fine as well. Just work quickly because you want to have it while the toast is still nicely toasted. So add whatever cheese you like. You can use crumbled feta. When I use crumbled feta, I use the pumpkin seeds, but today um, my favorite actually is the cream cheese with a little bit of garlic. I'm using kire kire. Uh, it's really delicious. So we're just going to crumble the cheese up and uh, add it like this in small little chunks. And then add the sunflower seeds, which is my favorite. You could also use pumpkin seeds. And then add these red pepper flakes. It's really delicious on this toast. You can add a squeeze of lemon if you like. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. Uh, you don't really need to add salt because the cheese has enough salt. And it's done. Have a bite. It's really delicious. Go ahead, give it a try and let me know. If you like my videos and recipes for the best global recipes, don't forget to subscribe, like and leave a comment. I hope you enjoy the quick video recipe. You can always take a picture and share with me on one of my social media links. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye.